The latest installment of the longest running Muay Thai series in North America begins now from the Broad Street Ballroom in Lower Manhattan with a matchup of teen phenoms. It's Ismael Izzy George taking on Tyreek Tag Boogie Garcia. Hello, everybody. My name is Ariel Agami, and alongside me is Phoenix Carnavalli, the host of the In Fighting Shape podcast. And we have the 14-year-old George going up against the 16-year-old Garcia. You can see Izzy is coming out with a little bit more of a traditional Thai uh, stance, and Garcia is doing a little bit more kickboxing movement. He's even, even though he's on the back foot, he times when he can land that leg kick. George. He's trying to use the boxing head work and, and, and hands, but really would like to see him keep his hands up. George making his amateur debut tonight, wearing the black trunks with the orange Seton logos, and he takes a couple of shots up top from Garcia. Garcia in the black and yellow trunks, pops off the ropes and throws another combination over the top. And a nice teep with the right leg from Garcia as well. A nice cut kick, you saw Garcia come underneath the kick. A little blood there you see trickling out of George's nose right now. Chris Wagner giving him a standing eight. And Garcia fired up right now. He's got some blood coming out of the nose of his opponent, George. Again, making his debut this evening. Garcia, Garcia effective uh, using tons of different types of shots. He uses his hands well, and then he'll come out with a kick. Right now, Izzy is on the attack. Throws a nice overhand right, which lands. Of course, this, these two amateurs, just 14 and 16 years of age, respectively, so full gear being used, obviously, and no elbows. George trying to rebound after that standing eight count. Good start for Garcia. We're in the black and yellow trunks tonight. Now that teep lands right to the midsection of George. As you hear the whistle, that will be being used in place of our bell this evening. So the whistle signals the end of round number one between these two amateurs, Ismael George and Tyreek Garcia. Great to have you along with us, everybody. Ari Lagami with Phoenix Carnavali from the Broad Street Ballroom. This is Friday Night Fights, brought to you by Mohegan Sun Resort and Casino. Great crowd on hand, as usual, from Lower Manhattan. Just a block away from the Stock Exchange. And an action-packed night ahead. We begin with two teenagers. Ismael George making his debut just 14 years of age, representing the Seton Gym in Astoria, originally from Paris, France, now resides in Queens, been training for about six years, and it all leads up to tonight, his debut, and the youngster is in tough against the 16-year-old Tyreek Garcia, AKA Tag Boogie, who comes in at just 16 years of age. This is Garcia's second amateur fight, he is 1-0. And Garcia will dump George onto the canvas. And the early going here in round two. Reiner's giving him warning not to throw. There are no judo type throws in Muay Thai. Body kick and a right hand over the top lands for Garcia. One of the reasons why George is getting caught a lot is he'll throw those kicks without setting up any hands first. And Garcia all over George and Cannon. Chris the Cannon Wagner, our referee, is going to have to step in again for another standing eight. More blood coming out of the nose of Izzy George right now. You see him, George, look over at his corner, looking for a little bit of direction. You know, when you see a fighter look over and they're at their corner, they're always kind of, hey, what's next? What should I do? That's a 147-pound affair. George trying to rebound after the standing eight. But it's Garcia landing leather as the fighters get tangled up. And have to separate for a moment. Garcia hits the canvas and gets up. Garcia is very confident with his boxing. You can see like he knows how to get his hands through Izzy's guard very well. Garcia walking Izzy George down throughout the first almost two rounds of this schedule three. And that's one thing about the tie stance. It could be a little bit square. George off balance again. Two fighters locked up against the ropes. 
George lands a knee to the body, but back comes Garcia. Yeah, Garcia not allowing George to, to establish any type of rhythm. Final 10 seconds of action here. George thought that was the end of the round. Yeah. Chris Wagner alerting the young fighter. And that is the end of round number two. You hear the whistle blow and tough situation here for Ismael George Phoenix, his first amateur fight. He's already tasted a lot of leather from Tyreek Garcia. Some blood coming out of the nose. How do you respond in a situation like this? He's such a young guy, just 14 years of age. Well, right now he's trying to get his footing in the ring and see what's going on. And what that's doing is that's causing him to wait. And while he waits, Garcia capitalizes. So it's the old saying, you know, be first, be fast. He's got to start using his gifts, and his gift is his range. But he's got to set that up well. So he needs to be a little faster and a little less hesitant. And that's hard to do when it's your first fight. You're trying to watch everything that's going on. You've got your corner. You've got the crowd. You've got your own energy. You've got your opponent. So he's got to just commit. He's got to commit to his strikes and go for it. Ismael George, a.k.a. Izzy, thrust into the spotlight tonight on Friday Night Fights. And he's just trying to survive the third and final round against Tyreek Garcia, who has forced a couple of standing eight counts from Chris the Cannon Wagner. So George likely will need a knockout to win his debut. Garcia trying to improve to 2-0. We're underway in round three. Yeah, you see he's committing to his strikes a little bit more. He's throwing them a little bit faster. The combination landing for Garcia and another right-legged teep. Effective weapon for Garcia in this fight so far. George on the attack now, trying to tie up Tag Boogie. Garcia in the black and yellow, George in the black and orange trunks. Garcia needs to work on that clinch and calming down in the clinch. Calming down, knowing that you can swim, you can you can get your underhooks in, you can you can find your position, you, you can be solid there even as a smaller fighter. Tyreek Garcia representing Jersey City kickboxing, trains under Paul Clark, trying to improve to 2-0 as an amateur. Well, he right looks good. The body. He looks good here. He knows how to use his hands effectively. He's switching up his shots, so he's not allowing George to get used to anything or even know what's coming. George is waiting. He's, being, he's hesitating. And Garcia, perhaps a little bit tired after expending so much energy on the attack through the first two rounds, taking a couple moments to catch his breath. Halfway through this third and final round, right hand lands for Garcia and another right-legged teep to the midsection of Izzy George. What Garcia is also doing well is he, is he uses his distance. He moves in and he moves out and he lets uh, George come to him. George trying to use that longer frame to lean on Garcia. Maybe a little bit too, little too late. Another right hand lands and a low legged kick causes George to lose his balance. No knockdown, says Chris Wagner. And Garcia's tired too. You can see it. Their adrenaline rushes, and that's it. And there is the whistle. Round three comes to a close, as does this amateur clash between up-and-coming teenage fighters. Ismael George goes the distance against Tyreek Garcia. This was a tough fight for both young men, but Garcia able to score standing eight counts in both the first and second rounds, and that will likely be the difference on the scorecards as we await the decision. Ismael George, the Paris, France native, trying to catch his bearings after a tough three-round debut, but he went the distance. And again, George representing Seton, Jim in Queens, a product of that gym who now runs his own camp up in Connecticut. That would be Omar Estevez in the ring, part of the Izzy George corner tonight. On the other side, Jersey City's own Tyreek Tag Boogie Garcia, poised to improve to 2-0 
Let's go up to Larry Legend. All right, ladies and gentlemen, your attention, please. First of all, give it up for both of these junior warriors who came out here and gave you their all in our opening contest. But there can be only one winner, ladies and gentlemen, the winner of this bout as a result of judges' unanimous decision. The red corner, Tyreek Tag Boogie Garcia. Representing Jersey City Kickboxing, Jersey City Kickboxing, your winner, Garcia. So Tyreek Garcia improves to 2 0. The 16 year old is impressive in his second amateur fight. Izzy George able to gut it out through three rounds in his debut, but it's Garcia taking the victory back to Jersey City. This is Friday Night Fights.